Whatever happened to field spells? This might be a weird question, but every modern deck seems to have an archetypal field spell. But more importantly, field spells seem to be turning into searchable, continuous spells. This is not an attack on terraforming, metaverse, or even demise of the land. Quite the opposite, as there is a long history of field spells being searchable. In fact, field spells have monsters which specifically search for them. Many field spells can be searched by a monster which discards itself. This is a one-for-one -one cycle and search, which puts a monster in the graveyard. This offers both deck thinning and setup for future plays. Very strong. My problem with field spells is that they seem to have become one-sided, or asymmetric. Let's look back at some of the older field spells, starting with Yami Yugi's Yami. The name is Japanese for darkness. It increases the attack of all fiend and spellcaster monsters by 200 points, and decreases the attack of all fairy type monsters by 200 points. This is a marginal boon, and I don't think it is enough to justify playing it, but it has two interesting features. The first is that it is universal, affecting all monsters of the chosen type, regardless of ownership. And second, that there is a trade-off. It is symmetric and strategic, as you could use it to power up your own fiends and spellcasters, and, in the right matchup, gain an edge over fairy decks. We can see this trade-off continue in the elemental field spells, which were considerably stronger in aggressive decks, balanced by the defense reduction. We also have cards like Necrovalley, which is super confusing, and I am not sure if Konami even knows what they wanted the card to do. But the important part is that it affects both players' graveyards, and boosts the attack of all Gravekeeper's monsters, regardless of ownership. Strategic and symmetric. Let's move on to GX. Look at the change from Skyscraper to Skyscraper 2 Hero City. You might not catch it at first, but Skyscraper can boost your opponent's elemental heroes, while Skyscraper 2 is asymmetric. There are other examples like the Seal of Ori Kalkos, which was like the elemental field spells, but had a much harsher downside in destroying your special summon monsters, as well as preventing you from special summoning. Not symmetric, but still strategic. Now turn your attention to the Gates of the Dark World, which has a symmetric effect boosting fiend-type monsters. And I should really point out that in mirror matches, the symmetric attack gain does not give you an edge over your opponent's monsters, but it does increase their threat level because they still have higher attack to deal more damage to their life points. But back to the card, there is also an asymmetric beneficial effect, with no drawback. There is no downside to playing this card. Gates of the Dark World is an older transitional card, but compared to something like Cosmotown, there is a whole lot of text on the card, but none of it is relevant to your opponent. There is no downside to playing Cosmotown, and a huge upside. Combine that with the tremendous strength and searchability of the card, and now you have a mandatory 3 of in any Cosmo deck. Although, I do recognize the diminishing returns of field spell searchers. The change in design space of field spells coincides with a mechanical change as well, with Master Rule 3 allowing each player to have a field spell up at the same time, furthering the sentiment of asymmetry. This also removed the hidden ability of field spells to destroy your opponent's field spell. Closed Forest is designed around this, giving itself a layer of protection against your opponent's field spells, similar to Field Barrier. The restriction of one field spell at a time added weight, you having cast a spell powerful enough to terraform the terrain, impacting both players. But now it feels like a continuous spell you activate as just another archetype piece to extend combos or add consistency. There's nothing wrong with modern field spells, but I just wish they would go back into the zone where they belong.